Okay, we made it to camp. Uh, not as much snow as we thought, so no problem. Let's uh, get camp set up and get a fire started and start cooking these ribs. What do you think, Bobby? Is this great? Bobby, 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 Bobby! Like I may have mentioned, I've camped here before, so I might have... I might have stashed some leveling blocks slash firewood in here. So let's try to get the camper leveled. Probably don't want to see my butt. Let's try to get the camper leveled. Put in the comments if that's wrong what I just did. Okay, this is what we came out here to do. We came out here to cook some ribs over the fire. And I got a feeling we're gonna be eating them in the dark, but that's okay. So I just have some spare ribs and I'm going to put some apple juice in there. I'm gonna uh, put some rub on them. I'm gonna put some mustard on them. I'm gonna put some honey on them. I'm gonna put some brown sugar on them. And I'm gonna cover this tin up with tin foil. Originally, I was just gonna wrap them in tinfoil, then I saw this on the way out of the house, and I thought, well, maybe I'll use that. So I'm gonna cut these and maybe, maybe cut this into thirds, maybe half, I don't know. Put it in there and just put some apple juice and just put all that stuff on it, cover it, put it in the fire. Uh, I don't want it super hot. I want it to cook for a couple hours. So it's just gonna sit in this thing and cook slow, as slow and low as I can in the fire, next to the fire. And then I'm gonna take it off put it on the grill, put some barbecue sauce on it, let that get tacked up, and hopefully they're gonna be delicious. I'm not looking for, or not expecting fall off the bone. That takes a slow cooking of six hours. I'm hoping for at least tender and delicious and not chewy. So let's get this started. A surprise for you guys on the way up here well I knew the area was gonna hopefully produce morels this year and uh, on the way up I pulled over and searched around the burn a little bit and found me some morels I didn't spend a lot of time but I've got a one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven of them so we're gonna cook us up some morels. Now, normally my camper has everything I need, but it didn't have butter. I am unplugged the refrigerator for a while, so I'm cooking these in olive oil, salt, and pepper. This is gonna be a treat. Well, the ribs are still cooking over here. Woohoo!
Wow. 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 Not the same as the blonde ones I get in Southern Oregon. A little overdone. Wow. We're going to eat these right up. How can something with a name like fungus taste so good? Yep. What a nice little treat. All right, everybody. I'm going to start paying more attention to these ribs. See you soon. All right, I think I mentioned it when I started cooking these, I had to be careful of the sugar burning. And that's exactly what happened. Like I said, I've never done this before. Um, so note to self, too much heat. Okay, well, the ribs are done. I haven't eaten any yet. I think they're gonna be okay. I did burn them. I burnt the sugars. I got impatient. I was, uh, I didn't let the bed of coals build up, but I still think they're gonna be good. But I'm pairing them with a stone, uh, stone circle cider made here in Estacada. I haven't had it, let's give it a try. Well, raspberry, that's pretty good. All right, stone, stone, blah, why, that's a tongue twister. Stone circle cider with my ribs. Let's give these things a try. I think they're going to be very good. All right. Oh, that's pretty good. Mmm. That's really not bad at all. Yes, I burnt some of the meat. That's coming off the bone. Well, all right, that's all I'm happy. I would do a few things different. Maybe I'd cook them first, then add the sugars, the honey, the brown sugar. Uh, do a dry rub, cook them, and then add those and cook them a little bit longer and then take them off and cook them over the fire. I would also be a little more patient with my heat. Um, get a fire started, get the coals over so I can control the heat a little bit more. But man, hey Bobby, what do you think? You like it? What do you think? Get that last piece right there. There you go. Is that pretty good, Bob? All right. Bob says it's good. Mm. A little cider. So let's recap. Last minute, I decided to leave my house. I had 
I took these out this morning and thawed them, but I left my house, I stumbled across some mushrooms, I found this great camp spot, hung out with my dog, cooked some ribs over the fire. You gotta get outside to do this. So, thanks everybody for watching. Tell me what you think of the ribs or how I cooked them. Tell me what you would do different. Let me know if you try them. If you try cooking them. All right, everybody. Remember, you got to get outside and get dirty. And I will meet you out there. See you guys.